Hi guys, it's Mr. Pharma. That is a fast drug race that's happening between the pharma companies for inventing drugs for COVID-19. But if you had noticed, there is a lot of talking about the price of the drugs, especially about branded drug and generic drug. Why is this topic so much talked about? Why is branded drug versus generic drug so important? What are they? What is the difference between them? Today we will see, we will resolve all the barriers and give a simple clear-cut overview of generic drugs versus the branded drugs in this video. This is Pharma Portal, the pharma you need to know, share and grow. This video is for basic understanding and learning purposes only. The content and facts may change time to time basis. So viewers discretion is advised. To understand a generic drug, first we should know what is a branded drug. A branded drug is a first invented drug by a pharma company who has the manufacturing rights of the drug for approximately 10 to 20 years to prevent the drug being copied. In simple terms, this is a new drug in the market which we can consider as an original version. Lot of money and time has been invested for bringing a drug to the market and after the health agency's approval, a drug enters the market and this new drug can be named by the company with the name brand name because lot of time and money is invested in patent research manufacturing etc the branded drug prices are high considering the huge money invested these drugs are patented to avoid the copy of the drug so what is a generic drug a generic drug is a medication created to be same as an existing approved brand name drug in dosage form safety strength route of administration quality and performance characteristics in simple terms, we can say generic drug is an equal substitute for its brand name counterpart. Generic drugs work the same as a branded drugs. Generic drugs are a copy of a branded name drug which must have the same quality, same safety, same strength. Approved generic drugs are generally only sold after patents and exclusivities of the branded drugs ends. Generic drugs are not exactly the same but they are effectively the same as the branded drugs. For a better understanding, let's see a simple example other than a drug, a potato chips. So when I say potato chips, most of us would have thought about only one brand, Lays. That's because they have earned a name brand, whereas the same chips is available in your nearby home and shops, which has the same active ingredient, potato, but with different flavors and shapes, which we consider here as a generic. Both branded and generic manufacturers follow the same rules set by the health agencies that meets the quality and safetyness of the product. Yes, this example makes us clear in understanding the difference between a brand and a generic. So how does a generic drug differ from a brand? The major difference between a generic and a brand is the price. Most generic costs 70 to 90 percent less than the brand. The generic drug manufacturer must prove that their product contains the same active ingredients as the branded drug and ensure that the generic drug maintains the same form, concentration and dosage as the original medication. A generic drug also may differ from a brand in the terms of shape, color or packaging because United States trademark laws do not allow a generic drug to look exactly same as the brand drug. Here you can see an example of a branded acetaminophen tablet price and a generic acetaminophen tablet price which has the same active ingredient. So let us now compare the branded drug with the generic drug. So the similarities are they must contain the same active ingredients, they must have the same dosage strength, they must have the same dosage form, they must have the same route of administration and they must deliver the same amount of drug concentration in the bloodstream. The differences are they can have the different sizes, shapes and colors, they can have a different inactive ingredients. Some important questions that commonly arise about generics are, are generics as effective as a brand? Yes. All health agencies like FDA ensures this via thorough testing and review of bioequivalence data. Lower in price of generics doesn't mean that lower in quality. It is equally safe and effective as branded drugs. Then why are generic drugs cheaper than branded drugs? Manufacturers of generic drugs do not have to repeat the years of costly research and clinical trials as the branded drug company. If generic drugs are better than the branded drugs, then why branded drugs are prescribed? Generic drugs cannot be sold until the branded drugs patent expire, which could take 10 years or more and also lack of awareness on the benefits of generics result in the prescription of branded drugs. 
So now let's see some of the myths and facts about generic drugs. Some of the myths are generics are not safe, generics are not potent, generics take longer time to act in the body, generics are made in substandard manufacturing facilities. These are all myths. So let's face the facts. Generics use the same active ingredient as the branded drugs and have the same risk benefit profile. Generic drugs have the same quality, strength, purity and stability as branded. The generic drug delivers the same amount of active ingredient the same time as the original drug. Substandard facilities are not permitted to manufacture by the FDA. So now let's see the impact of generic drugs. Generic drugs account 89% of the prescription dispensed in USA. Generic drugs saves almost $4 billion every week for patients. According to your study, generic drugs saved nearly $1.67 trillion from 2007 to 2016. Nearly 8 in 10 prescriptions are filled for generics. FDA generic drug program conducts 3,500 inspections of manufacturing plants a year, ensuring the GMP compliance. In India, generic drugs account for nearly 75% of the pharma market. Generic drugs ensure the lower economy people also get a good quality medicines. Hope you like this video. Encourage us by hitting the like button. If you have any questions, post it in the comments and share this video to your friends and family. Most importantly, subscribe and press the bell icon for regular notifications from our pharma portal channel. Bye.